Hey guys, today I'm going to be opening up and taking a look at this Loft to Love Loft House along with three lorry dolls and a bunch of furniture pieces to set up the Loft House. I'm so excited because our generation sent me all of these pieces, so thank you so much. I really do appreciate it and I'm so excited to take a look at all of them. The dolls look really adorable and there are four furniture pieces including the kitchen set that comes with the Loft. So let's open each piece, take a look at it, and then we can set up the dollhouse at the end. The first doll we'll be taking a look at is Hazel. So Hazel comes in a set with Happy, which is the dog, which is so much fun. Her outfit looks really adorable. She has some tights on and the dog comes with a leash. So on the back, you can see Hazel walking Happy and they're both so cute. So let's get her and Happy out of the packaging. Here we have Hazel and Happy out of the box and Hazel's hair is really soft. It's shoulder length when you have the headband in her head and her outfit's so adorable and fun and Happy has a little leash which I love. The first furniture set is the living room lounge set so the dolls can relax in the living room and let me show you the back. This is what it looks like. You can see it comes with a lounge set and a rug so let's get it out of the box. Here is the set up close. A lot of the pieces are plastic like the couch, the table, and also this little stool seat, but I'm sure the dolls will be able to sit on it nicely. The cushions are really nice and soft and I like the colors and how they both suit these two pieces and the rug is super soft. Here is the cozy bedroom set. It has a really nice bed and a couple of furniture pieces. On the back we can see it clearly and it kind of tucks in nicely. This is the bedroom set. It's really adorable. It comes with a bed, some pillows, blanket, mattress, which you can all remove, which I love. And I especially love the coloring of this set. This turquoise green color is so pretty. It also matches the dressing table. There's a mirror on the top and the drawers are all removable and you can put small accessories inside because there are a total of three. This is Gemma. She's a really fun doll and I can't wait to get her out of the packaging. Her outfit's adorable and here's the back of the box. This is Gemma out of the packaging. She is so adorable. I love her so much. Her purse is really fun and her hair is super long. This is the home workspace set. It's another accessory piece. What I love about it is that it comes with a laptop and also a chalkboard with real chalk so you can use it on the back. You can see it clearly and I cannot wait to get it out of the box. These are all of the pieces out of the packaging. I love the laptop, it looks so realistic while the chair, the wheels actually spin and so does this part as well. These two items are speakers, I wasn't too sure I had to check the box and this is a pencil holder but I'm sure you can turn it into a cup if you want it to. The globe spins too and the chalk is used to write stuff on the chalkboard. There is a huge grassy part on top of the loft and this is where you're meant to put the rooftop patio sets. The dolls can relax and have some tea or juice or whatever they want. So it comes with some really adorable pieces and you can see the dolls relaxing here. And you can see the grassy part and there are a lot of different accessories so fill up the whole space. These are all the pieces, it's really great. And what I love about this set is that there are two chair pieces and one lounge piece, and I have three dolls so they can all relax upstairs. The last doll is Lori. Of course we can't forget about her because it's kind of her collection, it's named after her. She has a really fun outfit on and she also has really cool shoes, so let's get her out of the packaging. This is Laurie out of the packaging and she's definitely a really fun mini doll and I can't wait to have her in the loft house. So now it's time to set it up with all of the different accessories and pieces and I think it will turn out great because everything is so adorable and works so well together. So let's get started. 
Let's take a look at the loft house up close. So on the bottom floor there is plenty of space, the door actually opens and closes, and the lights on the top you're meant to add batteries and it switches on and off which is really cool. And there's little cutouts that are meant to be for windows which is a nice touch. So I'm planning on putting the lounge set and the kitchen set down here. To get to the second level, the dolls walk up the ladder style stairs and the second level is half the size of the first level so it's a little bit smaller but you can still fit plenty of items. I'm planning on making this the bedroom study room because there's not much room to put anything anywhere else. This is the top part of the loft house and it's definitely the coolest part because it's actually grass, well it's not actually grass, but it's green and it's fluffy so it feels like it's grass, which I think is a really cool feature because they could have just painted it green and pretend it was grass, but they did that extra little thing which I love a lot. <laughs> On the first floor we have the lounge set and Matilda, Grace and Laurie are having a lovely chat together. It suits the dolls really nicely and you can see that they fit nicely as well. Next in the kitchen is Sage. She's cooking up some food for them. And what I love about the kitchen is that most of the cupboards do open and close and there are so many small compartments. On the second level we have one Leah walking up the steps and the other Leah and Gemma sitting on the bed. We have the study area in the back and it fits quite a few pieces. On the last section which is the garden area or the patio, Honey and Hazel are both relaxing and so is Izzy too. Overall, I definitely do recommend the loft house. What I love about it is it comes with the kitchen set already, which is great, and all the pieces fit in really nice and comfortably without feeling really tight. All the separate pieces are really adorable too. There is a lot of plastic sets, but I love all the small little accessories, and the dolls are too cute and their outfits are so adorable. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.